Hello, and welcome to Voices for Fun. Now, today we're going to do something a little different. We're going to enter the world of children's voices. Um, one of my very first jobs in the industry was doing the voice replacement for Alexander in the Ingmar Bergman film, Fanny and Alexander. And doing a 12-year-old boy who's about to be seduced by a woman was really a challenge. Fortunately, it didn't go much further than that. However, what I did learn from that very first time I did a voice of a child, because a 12-year-old is a child, was it's not enough to create the voices we've been talking about. We, or I, have to go into the consciousness of that. Now, for whatever reason, maybe because I was a tomboy growing up, I was able to do that. So what I want to do today very quickly is give you a little bit of a sample of how to do children's voices. So the first thing is you got to get into the consciousness. Without that, nothing's going to work. Then it's just, then it's just a cute and funny little voice and it's kind of obnoxious, actually. So for a younger voice, we're going to lift the palate. Remember we talked about the, if this were the side view and our mouth. So to do a younger child, you really have to make sure that there's a lot of space up here and that it's forward in, in the mouth. So this little boy would probably be about maybe six or five. And um, he actually is a little boy I created. And he has a little sister. And that little sister is being formed by moving that air slightly back. So here's the boy, and you can tell just by the forward movement of the air that that's a little more masculine. But what's really going on, what's really going on is it's all in my head. I can see the boy. The little girl is the same thing. And when they talk back and forth like this, hi Mikey, what are you doing? I'm not doing much. Do you want to help me? That is what's going on. I'm seeing them, in, seeing them in my mind, and because I know what the placement is, I'm able to go back and forth. So the boy is here, and the girl is here. And if you notice, to do the girl, it takes a lot more smile. <laughs> okay, that's lesson number one. See you next time. Bye. Yeah, bye.